Okay, buddy, what the fuck is going on? You're 13 years old on trend? Makami, please tell me this shit is a joke. Mate, you can't even recite the fucking alphabet yet, and you're already injecting foreign substances into your ass? What the hell is wrong with society to where this is actually normal? All right, everyone, welcome back. Today, TikTokers are actually glorifying steroids. I'm not actually sure where to even start with this shit. I don't think I've ever had to make a video on something as crazy as this, but this guy who we're looking at today is literally directly and indirectly promoting the use of performance enhancing drugs on Instagram. So this guy's name is Adam oh. Eats Tren. I mean, do I really need to say anything more about that? He's pretty much this kid who in his bio has 06, meaning he's about 17 years old. But then in his videos on Instagram, he's saying he's 12, he's saying he's 13, 14, 15. Who fucking knows at this point? No one knows how old this kid actually is. But he has around 20,000 followers on Instagram, most of which I'd assume are literal children and really don't know any better and are extremely impressionable. These are the type of people that would fall for any stupid video promoting steroids. These are people that are probably born after 2010, which is kind of crazy to think about in my opinion. So anyway, I found the absolute craziest videos from Adam Eats Trend today that glorify steroids, literally. So let's see just how fucking bad these get. Alright, already I gotta pause this shit. Let's take this guy's word for it that from the last clip that he's actually fucking 13 years old. What on earth is this goofy ass shit? If your ass ain't wet, you've got another set. Tell me, Adam, what influencer taught you to say that shit? Where did you learn that sentence? Look, I know when influencers say bad things, they sit there and say, oh, well, I'm not the parent of the audience. I shouldn't be given the burden of kids' development and, you know, I shouldn't have to watch what I say. Unfortunately, bro, this is the result of ignoring that responsibility. As an influencer, you have so many younger, impressionable fans that copy your every move. And this is the sh** that comes from it. I mean, bro, this kid is apparently 13, right? I don't care who you are. That's some weird sh** to say with your shirt off on an Instagram reel. A little sus, my man. A wise man once said, keep your top on because it gets chilly. As someone in Australia right now in the middle of f***ing winter, I have to heavily agree with that. It gets way too damn cold during Australian winter. Ain't no damn way I'd be taking my shirt off. <laughs> Hey, yo, what the f***? 13, bro. Remember that. Your ass is 13 years old. Look, I know it's not the same thing in the slightest, but imagine if a 13-year-old girl was doing this shit. We'd be f***ing up in arms about it, calling for Instagram to take it down. I'll tell you right now, if my 13-year-old daughter was doing some shit like this, I'd be throwing her phone into the garbage disposal immediately. I couldn't imagine something like that happening. I'd call my parenting journey off immediately and just accept that I'm a failure of a man and as a parent. Now, one thing I've got to ask right here about this guy is why the hell is he lying? lying about his age. A lot of you in the Monk army are watching this and probably thinking, oh, well, Monk, it's clearly a joke. He's got 06 in his bio, meaning he's 17, so what's the problem? The problem here is that it's just not a joke. This guy's saying he's 13 in one video, saying he's 12 in another video, 14 in another, you know, 15, whatever. But the thing with Instagram Reels, TikTok, YouTube Shorts, Snapchat Spotlight, if you're psycho enough to use that, is that every video pretty much has a different audience each time. Every video gets shown to new and new people. Rarely, unless you're already famous, will your YouTube shorts or just short form content get shown to the same person multiple times. What this means is that some random 12 year olds are only being shown one of this guy's videos where he's sitting there saying he's 13 and on trend, so people are gonna believe it. And this guy doesn't look old by any means. He looks young as shit, so people are gonna believe that. It's different on YouTube because for the most part, and I'll use the Monk channel as an example, the same people come back to watch every single video. I have a consistent audience that know my joke and understand what I'm saying. When I call you guys the Monk Army, you know what I'm talking about. And I hope you comment that right now because I'll give you a heart if you do. No one when they randomly scroll past this guy in their feed is going to know this guy's jokes and check his profile to see if, he, if he's actually 13. They're just going to take it at face value and see, oh wow, this guy's 13 taking trend. So that's why it's not a joke. People actually believe you, Adam. <laughs> No, 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 no. Okay, this kind of started off as a joke, but this oil up trend is fucking wild. Even if this guy isn't 13, which if he actually is, would be unreal, by the way, and Instagram would have no choice but to take your ass down. But if he's 17, this is also weird as fuck. Like, bro, I get it if you're 18 this year, but you're not 18 yet. You're still a minor. Doing this shit at any teenage year is fucking 
fucking weird to me. And bro, what the hell are these comments? Oil up for me, big bro. Oil up at 20k. Bro, how down bad do you have to be to oil up at 20k? Maybe 100k or 1 million, I could maybe understand. But 20k, you're kind of selling yourself short there, buddy. If it was me, I'd wait to at least 1 million before I oil up. Don't take that as a challenge, by the way, Mark Army. <sighs> What's that? Brother, ooh. Baby, do you know what that's worth? Brother, ooh. Alright, no, 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 ain't no fucking way. Let's break this shit down here for a second. Not for human consumption, I mean, come on! You're what, 13, 14, 17, whatever the fuck you are, under 18, and you're promoting some shit that quite literally says not for human consumption. I mean, need I say more, bro? Got two different types of pumps. Adam eats Tadalafil. Now, Tadalafil, which is the substance he's taking here, which is not for human consumption, is Cialis, which is pretty much used for people with EDs. Now, I'm not sure if that's something a 13 to 17 year old should be using, let alone promoting, but each to their own, I guess. And to those saying, oh, well, Mark, he's not promoting it, he's just making a video saying that he takes it. It really doesn't matter, bro. On the internet, sitting there making a video with you taking something and then posing, acting like it's really good and, oh, look, look, guys, it works. That's promoting it whether you like it or not. Sure, you're not trying to promote it, but that's exactly what you're indirectly doing. Lil Bro needs to stop watching Togi content. Now, Togi Togi is actually an adult and he's pretty much another content creator that also indirectly promotes steroids. He's making videos with his mate David Rao who I also made a video on and it really does look like Adam over here who is younger impressionable audience member of Togi and David Rao has followed down the exact pipeline. This is exactly what I said in my TikTok gym influencers are going dark video. These guys have a young audience and whether they like it or not what they're doing in these videos their audience will also do. So you need to be careful what you post bro. Seriously, like bro, that's just kind of disgusting if you ask me. At least this content doesn't promote steroids or Cialis or whatever the f*** this guy's got going on. But I mean, this entire account still just kind of shows how detrimental spending all your time on f***ing Instagram and short form content can be. Bro made me lose my nofap streak? Yeah buddy, the police are on their way. I don't know what the hell you think you're doing. Seriously, there's no f***ing way you just commented that sh publicly. This is why we broke up in the first place. Cause I yeah, man, I don't even give a sh bro. I just do it anyway. Like, bro, how can anyone look at a video like this and say, yeah, that's fine, no problem with that? Because I sure can't. What is it with people that go to the gym randomly just ending up on a villain arc? Like, bro, I get it. She broke up with you. That sucks. But that's no reason to half your life expectancy in return for some muscle and strength. Anyways, I'm done with Adam Eats Trend. Click the video on screen right now because YouTube thinks you'll enjoy it, and I'll see you all over there. Subscribe.